Oliver's rise in my soul, family. So when it comes to this Zodiac thing, it's not meant to be literal. It's only a metaphor. And proof is many fortune tellers and astrologists say any humanoid male born on any day of Scorpio is going to have females flock to them and always blowing up their phone. And that's not true by any stretch of false information you read on. My solar return day is October 25th, first day of Scorpio. And in my first 26 years of my current lifetime existing, no humanoid females around my age group or older flock or blew my phone up for me to bang their guts to me. The way most humanoid females on earth flock to these soulless vibrational sellouts. And reason why is because I be so advanced and create new dimensions within myself to think and feel deeper with my mind, heart, and soul eye. That is too otherworldly for 99.9% .9 of humanoid females on earth. Rather, I see them online or in person. Plus, I don't fit in the narcissist slave owner matrix and I'm one of the chosen ones. So it was never by design for me to have experiences that matrix soulless vibrational males have with the humanoid females anyways. So with that finally being said, humanoid females flocking to a humanoid male has nothing to do with his zodiac chart at all. The way the astrologers be claiming because humanoid dudes who focus on themselves and be to themselves healing the multiverse don't really have a lot of these humanoid females flock to them. You feel me? And look, this is proof that Zodiac should not be taken literal when it comes to quintillion plus humanoid females flocking to Scorpio males. It's false information by astrologists and spiritual humanoid males don't have these humanoid females flock to them. Even if the humanoid females are posting spiritual stuff, they don't flock to otherworldly guys. As a male who solar return on the first day of Scorpio, October 25th, no humanoid female around my physical age group or older in history as long as I've been on social media or go anywhere. My aura was too strong and too soulful for these humanoid females. So it was true on females. So if it was so if this was true on females craving Scorpio males, then every video I done, I should have had new females in each vid I ever done in the multiverse. I know plenty of guys who aren't born on days of Scorpio and humanoid females flock to them like people attending Super Bowls in the Cancun. And it's only because those guys operate on a matrix artificial frequency and not chosen one spiritual frequency. So in order to be a quote unquote set symbol to 99.9% .9 of humanoid females, the humanoid male would have to fit in the matrix selling out on some selling out for record deal vibrations. I know humanoid females having different birthdays of each month and regardless of any month, many dudes be flocking to them online and in person. So it's not a Scorpio thing when females and males want to flock to someone. It's either you fit in the matrix or you're too spiritual to the point most can't even bother to look at you or even comprehend your soulful frequency that they be too intimidated. 